In this lesson, we're going to take an equation that involves two different variables, and we are going to complete ordered pairs. So what we have here are ordered pairs given to us with one of the variables left blank in that ordered pair. So in part A, we know the x value is 2, but it's asking us to fill in what the y value should be if x equals 2. And so uh, the strategy here is simply to plug in the variable we know from the ordered pair and then solve for the other variable to find the one we don't know. So we'll take 3x plus 2y equals 12. So we're just completing ordered pairs so that the ordered pair is going to be a solution to this equation. So when x equals 2, what should y be? So of course we simplify there first. 6 plus 2y equals 12. We subtract 6 from both sides. 2y equals 6. And then we can divide by 2 on both sides to get y equals 3. And so that means that my completed ordered pair would be 2 comma 3. And that is going to be a solution to this equation. All right, so moving on to part B. This time we know the y value. The y value is 4. So we'll say 3x plus 2 times 4 equals 12. And of course, this time solve for x. So 3x plus 8 equals 12. Subtract 8 from both sides. 3x equals 4. And then divide both sides by 3. We end up with x equals 4 thirds. And so we know that the completed ordered pair, that would be a solution to the equation 3x plus 2y equals 12, would be 4 thirds comma 4. And then one last example. We know the y value is negative 2, so 3x plus 2 times negative 2 in place of y equals 12. 3x plus negative 4 equals 12. Okay, so that's of course a lot of people would rather have a subtraction sign there, but you could have left it as plus negative 4, but either way, the way to get rid of it is to add 4 to both sides. So 3x equals 16, and then we isolate x by dividing by 3 on both sides. So x equals 16 thirds. So the completed ordered pair, that would be a solution to 3x plus 2y equals 12 would be 16 thirds comma negative 2.